for mystery. And Biscayne Bay is striking, as you can see there, a chord. Grand piano suddenly appeared on a sandbar. Question is, who put the 650 pound musical instrument there and why? Matt Gutman is on the case. One day in the middle of Biscayne Bay, it just appeared, a grand piano on a sliver of a sandbar. The mystery piano is making a lot of noise. Yeah, but how did it get there? That's the big question. I woke up one morning and it was just out there. It's a mystery, who put it there? It's like, do my eyes deceive me? We've never seen a piano in the middle of the bay like that. We hopped on a boat to try to solve this enigma. From afar, this looks like some sort of mythical sea creature. Up close, even worse. So we don't know how the piano got here or who brought it here. We do know that it's trashed, it's probably not going anywhere, and that it was sold at Bradford's in Milwaukee. That's where the trail goes cold. Rumors are swirling. Maybe it was a publicity stunt for last night's opening of a new Frank Gehry designed performing arts center. Yeah, you know, the truth is I wish we had done that. It's a great idea. Our charter boat captain told us he saw a boatload of people on the sandbar the first day the piano appeared. It appeared to me that they were doing a music video, and I'm sure that piano came off that boat, was a little too heavy to get back on that boat, so they just end up leaving it here. And there it is. The state officials tell us they'll only remove it if it becomes a water hazard. Music to our ears. For Good Morning America, Matt Gutman, ABC News, Miami.